hey guys welcome back to my channel i'm ijoma if you don't already know yes yeah, yet another tutorial on head wraps this one i did today is just so so very simple very very simple easy to do tie head wraps so just sit back and watch and enjoy while you watch this i just want to um drop a little thoughts on this issue that has been bugging me for a while i'm just trying out this system of video so as to know if it's gonna work for me all right guys so we're going to be talking about marriages in this time and age i don't know what it is that is making marriages crumble that is making marriages feel now but it is becoming um, appalling it is becoming too much these days people are made to realize or people are made to believe that marriages do not work anymore I don't know where they get that notion from and then young people that are not yet married now have that um, mentality that once they go into marriage and it's not working the next thing is just to opt out opt out i feel that kind of mentality it is very very um disturbing yes that's the word it's very very disturbing because I, I see no reason why you feel like having a forever journey with someone and then you now have it at the back of your mind that once there is a mess up you immediately want to leave i believe that the reason for breakup or divorce should be something very extreme life-threatening or if it demeans if it demeans your self-esteem or if it has anything to do with your mental health if it doesn't um, boost your uh, mental health or if it always brings it down i think those are the only reason why anyone should consider opting out of a um out of a marriage but these days you just see someone get married today after spending the whole money and planning and running a wedding and then before you know it in three months four months one year they are already out of it like it is it is mind-boggling it is disturbing like it is <laughs> i just wonder how it it's easy for someone to just opt out of a marriage without even giving it a try without even trying to see if it's gonna work without trying to work on it on your marriage it is a marriage for a reason so i it just boils down on me believing that we younger generations are not willing to take up the responsibility of making things work because if we try to make our friendship our relationships our marriages if we try to put in a little effort it's going to last long it's going to you, you tend to get to understand each other as time goes on even though i know that working on marriages relationships friendship can be so tiring can be so um so much of a work but still give it your best give it a try and see if there will be a change only if your partner or the person you're dealing with is an unrepented person that doesn't feel like he or she see, or doesn't see anything wrong with what he or she is doing then you can think of other means or other way of finding peace for yourself but aside that let's try to um work on friendships relationships marriages especially just because that marriage that relationship is ten tends to be our place of solace i don't know how to put it like it's supposed to be a place of peace for us it's supposed to be a place of rest like where you go to and have ease like there is nothing nothing beats having someone that is there for you 100 percent so that is what marriage i feel marriage is having a companion that is ready to stand by you that is ready to support your every move and that is ready to do forever with you do you know what it means to want to do forever with just one person so i feel we need to put in a little work to make it work rather than just work up to out once there is a little challenge 
like take for instance when um younger generation face a challenge in a marriage the next thing is they'll say that i need a break i need space i want to break up i'm no longer interested you know without even trying to work or trying to see what is going to if i'm trying to see if anything is going to help amend that um fuck up that they have so guys you know what brought about this talk with me this uh, morning is this Niniola, I forgot his name, I don't know how to pronounce his name, that announced he, the breakup with, in his marriage and the thing was so so painful because these people were couple goals for a lot of people, there are some people that are online that if you tell me they are going to break up, I will tell you it's a lie. And that guy and the way he flaunts his family, the way the way you see them relate, I don't know if it's just because they are in the faces of people, I don't know. But they've made people to believe that their marriage is so so okay and nothing is going to shake it. Only for them to come out and then announce that they are no longer together. A lot of Nigerians were left distraught, they left in disbelief because that wasn't even what they saw days back. So it was it was so so disturbing for so many people i included but i just felt <laughs> what is happening to our marriages these days what is really really going on like how did our mothers our fathers kept it alive kept it going in the in the olden days uh, how did they make it work they need to give us that um they, say, they need to give us the tips the tricks on making our marriages work and enjoyable I know that some of you will feel uh, the reason why those olden days marriages worked it was because uh, because the women were submissive and because the women were allow- allowed the men to trample upon them, blah, blah, blah. I know, I know that so many people have that belief, but then that it's not, it is not all true. It is not all through true. There are so many other factors that also helps in making the marriages relationships work like i just wish um i just wish there is more like a a, a handbook or a textbook or a a book that just lists out the things that help marriages last longer then because if we keep it up like this in the next years to come people are not going to stay married more than a week or two and then they feel it is okay to just walk out of it now this video is not to encourage any form of um any form of um violence or any form of negativity in marriage if you know you are in a relationship a friendship or a marriage and you feel you are, your life is threatened or you don't feel welcome any longer in that relationship please do well to live take your mental health um serious take your life very very serious so i'm not saying if you are feeling threatened you should stay stuck in it no please don't don't get me wrong okay guys thank you very much for watching this video this far i really really appreciate you for my new subscribers i love you and for the old ones you guys are the real deal thank you so so much love you don't forget to subscribe bye